We are back for part two of our Pokemon adventure. We're gonna we're gonna catch them all, and if we don't catch them all, we're gonna kill them all. Cause you know one is easier than the other sometimes. So let's do it. We're on the second floor, and this is not where we need to be. We gotta go meet the 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 big boss of this place. The guy that runs the... So I... The guy that runs the place I work at, who is like the big boss, I guess. I don't want to give away where I work. Uh, gave me... Just just gave me a bag of mini eggs when I was on break. I was like, okay, cool, thanks. <laughs> uh, yeah. I was like, oh, thank you. Uh, I have been waiting for you. I'm Kame Kameido. Kamado? Commander of the Galaxy Expedition Team. Hmm. So, you're Brady. Uh. <laughs> yes, sir. Hmm. I've been, br I've been briefed on your situation, including how you fell from the... I just realized, is my game loud enough? Like, I could turn it up. We're gonna... Actually, give me a second. Let me see something. We're gonna go back and we're gonna look at one of my streams. My most recent stream. Um, how do I look at my content? Why is there like a two minute and 20 second? Oh wait, no, it's because the start of the stream probably. Can we like slow down the text? I know for the gate. Yeah. Yeah. I think we're good turning it up. Let's just uh, hope that this is a good level. Uh, I've been briefed on your situation, including how you fell from the rift in the sky. I like how everybody just believes that. Now then, let's see what you're made of. Face me in combat. Am I gonna fight you? Fist fight you? Uh, try to throw him and charge at him. <laughs> what the fuck? Hiya! Hmm, you've got some fight in you. Your sumo needs work, but I do see some potential. Don't expect a warm welcome from everyone, naturally. Soon... Soon? Some. Holy shit. I read that as soon, and then my brain said it as soon, but it says some. I'm dying, man. Uh, some will be slow to trust an outsider, and some people will just be slow, uh, who literally fell right out of the blue. The superstitious among us might see your arrival as a portent of disaster. What does that mean? I've never heard that word. What the hell is that? A sign of warning that something, especially something momentous or calamitous, is likely to happen. Okay. Interesting. Uh, the superstitious among us might see your right. Oh, yeah, right. I agree. Um, but you passed the trial that was put to you. No matter how old, no matter how odd you may seem. That's rude. Uh, you're part of Jubilee Village now. Dedicate yourself to the work of the Galaxy Expedition Team and complete the Pokedex. But I warn you, Brady, Pokemon are terrifying creatures. Keep your wits about you as you work. 
I like how nobody's concerned about this kid, really, and where his parents are, and like why he fell from the sky, really, and just any questions in general that they they could be asking him, but they're not asking him. Uh, the Galaxy Themes Enter Trial Complete! Look how the Abra's just in the background there. Although its floating is a little bit framey. Uh, so the commander has also accepted you. But understand this, you begin as a no-star recruit among our ranks. In other words, you have no rank at all. The hell just happened to her hair? Uh, perform well as a member of the Survey Corps, and you will move up through the ranks. Indeed. You see, the more you add to the Pokedex, the higher your rank will become. And working on the Pokedex will also, of course, bring you closer towards that goal of yours. To seek out every last Pokemon. Here, you will need this. You obtained a recipe for crafting Pokeballs. A recipe for crafting Pokeballs from scratch. Required materials. One Apricorn and one Tumblestone. And 3,000 as well. You will have to buy the necessary materials. Thank you. Akari, you are an expert at crafting yourself. Teach our new recruit what he needs to know. Of course, Captain Silene. Now, as the experienced craftsperson here, let me explain a bit to start with. Crafting means making items with your own two hands. You can buy some items at the general store, but self-sufficiency is worth striving for. You can even make our most valuable tools, Pokeballs, think where... Think where we'd be if we couldn't do that. Let's head to the crafts work. The basics of crafting. Visit the Craftworks to learn how to craft items. Isn't there like a person that asks to see Shanks? I guess you have to just straight up catch another. Uh, well done, earning a place in our team. My name is Anth. I'm the local clother. Clothier? I don't know. The professor asked what I... The press. I'm just so brain dead. Uh, the professor asked that I ready you a change of clothes, so here you go. I do hope they fit. I just got clothing. Why are you giving me more? You received an everyday kimono and a pair of everyday trousers. I hope you avail yourself of the village's humble shops. Okay. This way to the crafts work, Brady. I can't just like craft in my own area. I'm gonna go back here to change clothing. I think I prefer the normal sandals. I guess I don't have... Hey, maybe I've seen you here in the village before. 
Oh, so I can buy items from you. A revive. So they have revives in the game. Good to know. Um, okay. I'd rather learn how to craft that. You can use the workbench here at the crafts work anytime you need to make an item in the village. And I'll supply what you need to make your first Pokeballs once you're ready to begin. Call it my way of saying congratulations on joining us. Just spend the money you got from the captain on clothes or whatever you think is best. Go up to the workbench and choose an item to craft, in this case a Pokeball. You can use the workbenches in Jubilife Village and the base camps to craft Pokeballs and other items. Crafting items requires a recipe and the necessary materials. So I'm going up to here. I'm going to craft a Pokeball. How many am I going to craft? I think I'm going to craft 20. Because that's how many I can make. Basics of crafting. Oh ho! Now that's some fine craftsmanship. Hard to believe this was your first time stepping up to the workbench, my boy. Is your clothing burned? I need to see it again. You'll recall, of course, that Pokemon possess the odd power to shrink themselves down. With the Pokeballs we craft, we can make use of that power to catch them. Also, that more Pokemon species can be duly recorded in a Pokedex. I feel like I read that completely wrong. Uh, and so that note, and on that note, holy shit, I am not kidding. My brain is just dead today. And on that note, here you are. This is why I need characters to speak and not me reading constantly. This is why I don't read books. This is why I listen to audio books, although I do read comics and shit and I have some books behind me. He received a Pokedex. A volume for compiling the collected results of much Pokemon research. Professor Laviton continually adds to it with each report made on new Pokemon species. Tasked with unreported data, 8. Look at them! Look at these adorable little bastards! I prepared this volume just for you. I hope it aids you well in your aim to seek out all the Pokemon there are in this grand region. Yeah, for a second I thought his shirt was burned, but I guess it's just horribly textured or something. Uh, you'll have to complete lots of research tasks to help the professor fill out the Pokedex. Same goes for me, of course. I've also got Pokemon to research as a Survey Corps member. Yeah, but your research doesn't help me. Uh, I'd be all too happy to explain more about the research tasks I could use your assistance with. Come join me at the Fieldlands camp whenever you are ready, my good Brady. Look at those shoes. Like, they're terrible. Like, his boots are better than what both of us are wearing. Hey, excuse me, I couldn't help it over here. If you're going to the Fieldlands camp, would you mind taking care of a request for me? Absolutely. I'm standing guard, so I can't leave my post, but I'll be here at headquarters if you want to talk about it. People who have something to ask you will have a request icon displayed above them. If you, f if you fulfill their request, you may receive a nice reward. Sick. I'm all about doing side quests. Hey, so there's this Pokemon called Wurmple. Have you heard of it? Yeah. Well, you see, I was hoping... I was having a chat with Professor Laviton, and he told me that after a Pokemon gains a certain amount of experience through battling and the like, it will sometimes change its appearance and become stronger. He said it was a phenomenal... Ev a phenomenal... A phenomenon called evolution. Some Pokemon can undergo evolution, which changes their appearance and stats if one of your Pokemon has met the requirements to evolve. 
you'll be able to select the Evolve option when viewing the Pokemon in your satchel. And so I decided I want to raise a Wurmple myself and have it evolve. You're part of the Survey Corps, aren't you? If you catch a Wurmple, could you let me have it? There'll be a reward in it for you, I promise. Just give me a Wurmple if you can. Sick. I could catch Pokemon for other people. Love it. We're gonna catch this man a Wurmple! Those ears, hmm. No, I can't recall them. I know Shank's ears had odd markings on the insides, but what were they? No use. I can't remember this. I can't remember. This will keep me up all night. Hey, aren't you with the Survey Corps? If you catch a Shinx, could you show it to me? I've got to see one with my own eyes. Please, I can't remember for the life of me what those ears look like. It's driving me up the wall. What does Shinx look like? Can't I just show him I have a Shinx? Alrighty, let's have a peek at those at these round ears. And that's it. Its ears have that yellow cross pattern on them, kind of like a star. Can't tell you what a relief this is. Felt like I had a bone stuck in my throat. Only the throat's my brain and the bone's a thought. Thanks for helping me get that bone out. so weird. What did Shank's ears look like? How do I get more recipes? That's what I'm curious about. Like, how does that happen? Am I gonna get it for, like, completing quests and stuff? Like, will people give that to me? Because I feel like that's more rewarding than just getting, like, three potions. I think that's what that guy just gave me. Um, so... Wait, what's this? Is this another quest? I wonder what a Starly would look like. Uh, you're that newcomer who fell from the sky. Are you heading outside the village? Of course you are. The survey corpse must have to get out and about to compile that Pokedex book they're working on, right? Well, on your way, kindly do me a favor. Find out all about Starly. Pokemon certainly are terrifying creatures, but when I see Starly, I feel simply whole. Not that I have the least desire to actually touch one, mind you. Please... Let me see Starly, Starly's entry in that Pokedex the moment you've completed it. Okay... Can I... What do you mean? How do I... Does... What does it mean to complete it? Like, get all of these things? Possibly? How do I look at my tasks? Is there a way to look at them? Yeah, there is. we will attempt to complete it. <laughs> I 
Heading outside the village, are we? Stay safe out there, kid. Righto, let's get to it then, shall we? In order to complete this Pokedex of yours, or of ours, there are a great many research tasks I'll need your help to carry out, my boy. The details of these tasks can be found in the Pokedex for you to reference anytime. Uh, research tasks are tasks you need to carry out to complete the Pokedex. Each Pokemon species has a different number and variety of research tasks. Press the down button to open your Pokedex, then check your then check what kind of research tasks are available for the Pokemon you've re you've registered. Uh, when you focused on a wild Pokemon in the field using the ZL button, uh, you can also instantly check the research tasks for that species by pressing the down button to open the to open your Pokedex right to that page. Uh, some Pokemon have some unusual research tasks, so be sure to check them out. You must catch and battle diverse Pokemon species and carry out plenty of research tasks. Uh, do so and you'll gain research points and other rewards for your work. One last piece of advice, Brady. If you see a wild Pokemon attack coming your way, dodge like your life depends on it. Dodge? Uh, here. Watch closely, and remember what I do so you can do it later. Huh. Yeah, what's the button that you just hit? That beautifully flowing bit of gymnastics is what we call a dodge. If you're light on your feet, you can dodge out of the way of wild Pokemon's attacks. That way, hopefully, you can avoid taking a beating and blacking out in the wilderness. The security corps have to collect me when I got the business end of some Shinx Thundershock. But don't you worry, I've got lots of experience to draw on, and I'll teach you plenty. Now, let me share some Survey Corpse Wisdom. Focus on a Pokemon with a ZL button, then press down button on the Pokedex. You'll see what tasks you have for that Pokemon. You might have noticed that you have a research task to do with how many Bidoof you've caught. That's right, catching just one isn't enough. You need to catch two, then four, then more and more. And when it's time to battle a Pokemon, remember the captain switches wis remember the captain's switching wisdom. If you have items out, press X to ready your Pokemon. Give it a try now if you want. I'll go on ahead. Good. I think you've got it, but as a reminder, don't forget to open your Pokedex when you focus on a Pokemon to check. Oh, well, I just skipped something. Uh, 
uh, to take a research test for it. Uh, it's just the elven down. Try checking your test for Starly next. Okay. Move your task is to catch the Starly without being spotted, right? For that task, try catching them while hiding in some tall grass. I'll go wait for you up ahead. Come catch up once you've finished some tasks. Sounds good. Damn it. It says catch it without being noticed. go. Um, number caught. Number of heavy spe specimens you've caught. Numbers defeated. Number of different forms you've obtained. We should work on you. So let's catch some oh, without being spotted. Let's keep doing the spotted one. Stuff. What the dots mean?
Give me that. I see a Pokemon I haven't caught before. fighting you. Maybe it's the wrong Pokemon, but we're using it. Oh, wow. You got to attack first? And... Fight. Come back. I swap out my Pokemon. It doesn't look like a can right now. Around here, you can find a Pokemon called... Yeah. Uh-huh. I already caught one. That means it'll try to hit you with its moves just, just like Shinx. And you'll need to battle it to catch it. Uh, if you take too much damage within a short time, you'll be in danger of blocking out. You can tell you're in danger when the edges of the screen turn red. Damage goes away over time, but you won't begin to recover if you're still being targeted by wild Pokemon. If you take further damage after the edges of the screen have turned red, you'll become overwhelmed and black out. Uh, and speaking of which, your research tasks for uh, Beasel include seeing it use a certain move. Uh, to be precise, you have to see... It use the move in battle. That's right. Some tasks require battling. Now I'll go on ahead. You take care of some of Bizzles. I don't. I just don't know how to say that. Research tasks. Then come talk to me. I wish I knew how to say that. Uh, I have already caught one. I should have been able to attack first. Ooh, we got another. Okay, let's, uh, Try to heal my guy.
Honestly, weird how different of a game this is. Was it a wormhole? Mime Jr. I was going to say Mr. Mime Jr. Bonita. Why is that glimmering like that? Join me. Join me. Damn it. Why are you in the water? This seems like a dangerous place for you to be. Another one. Enjoy us. Got to keep catching more, uh, more of you. Kobe. <laughs> Not even close. Fuck. Why are you running? A real son of a gun.
You're really doing quite well for yourself. Here, a little reward for keeping up with me. Your own crafting kit. What does that mean? A kit containing everything you might need for crafting, even when there is no work... Then what's the point of the workbench? However, you can only use the materials you have in your satchel. Okay. You can select the crafting kit from the key items pocket in your satchel to craft items wherever and whenever you like. However, unlike at a workbench, you'll only be able to use the materials in your satchel and you'll and you won't be able to craft more items than your satchel can hold. Can I craft items I don't have at the workbench? Is that what it's saying? Here's a recipe potion. Here's a recipe for potions too. Fantastic. Um, one orange berry and one medicinal leek. Okay. What part of your body is this? That's your legs. My dog is laying under the table. Doxty. He's a cute boy. With a crafting kit, you can craft items anywhere using any materials you have in your satchel. So long as you've got an apricorn and a tumblestone, you can make a pokeball at any time. Or make a pokeball at any time. Uh, or with an orange berry and a medicinal leak, uh, you can make a potion too. So do heal your Pokemon. Uh. How goes your research? The cover of your Pokedex will tell you if there are tasks you finished and can report. Oh. I'm so confused. How do you... How do you go about reporting stuff? Oh, okay, I have to go to him every time. Can I fight you? If you're feeling worn out, have a rest in a tent at one of our base camps. You can also rest there to pass some time. If it's nighttime and you're scared to be out surveying, the tent is a fine option. Okay. Did I not hit him directly in the head?
How many can I craft? 11. Do it. Great. How many... We need to catch 20. Yo, leveled up. Move, mastered. I don't know what that means, but cool. Oh, can I, like, move them physically up and down? Maybe not. Do you want to quit changing your Pokemon moves? Yes. It looks like you can swap out any moves they learn. Is that what it is? Because if that's the case, that'd be really fucking cool. A Pokemon saw me. You, get away. Get away from me. I want you, I will have you! Gotcha, bitch! I was wrong! Hell no! To the no, no, no! Hell to the no! Ugh, terrible. I'm like way far off from ever hitting these. it's seeing me when it does the dot 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 thing I can't throw it no oh it sees me does it see me
Gotta catch them all, gotta catch them all. There we go. We hit 10. Let's head back for now. Need to get more Pokeballs. Crafting kit. Uh, it seems a good time to explain to you about survey reports and the rewards they offer. When you submit survey reports, you'll receive money based on the level and number of Pokemon you've caught. You'll receive more money if you've fulfilled certain conditions, such as catching a species for the first time. On that note, let me check the research tasks you've completed thus far. Can I... Next. Almost 3,000. Okay. Hmm, I see. Most, in, most illuminating. I'll update our Pokedex with this new data. By carrying out research tasks and submitting survey reports, You'll raise the research levels of the Pokemon species you encounter. If you raise a Pokemon's entry to level 10, that entry will be considered complete and you will have unlocked all of the details, the detailed information to be had about that species. As you carry out tasks and complete the Pokedex entries for different species, you'll also gain Pokemon research points, which you can view on this, on the cover of your Pokedex. Uh, once you've earned a certain number of points, you'll be able to move up through the ranks of the Galaxy Expedition Team. Uh, oh yeah, Preferred Foods! Yeah, so you learn about this. So you know how to, how to catch them. Uh, this Pokemon has only just been documented. Investigation is ongoing. More research tasks must be completed to file in this Pokemon's entry. Let's see Starly, because Starly is level 10. Very good. Research level complete. Okay. So, research level 5, because I've seen it use Quick Attack. Okay. Species newly registered. Blech. Species newly registered are or updated. Okay, great, awesome. Uh, uh, not quite there yet. I'm afraid you'll need to complete a few more tasks before you're ready to go up on, go up a rank. I'd recommend you work your way through Bidoof's and Starly's tasks first. Hang in there. Sounds good. But uh, I'm gonna head back to the village if I can. Oh yeah, I do. I want to see my Pokemon. Okay. Let's, uh... Yeah, let's re release, right? No, 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 actually, you won't release these ones. Um... Do you wish to release? Yes. Can I, like, select a bunch?
kind of annoying having to do this. Not. Doesn't seem like there's a quick way to do this. Oh, well, maybe there is. Gravel. Mysterious gravel that can raise the effort level for one of a Pokemon stats. It can be used only if the effort level is at least level 3 and no greater than level 5. Okay. Right. Can I buy? Can I buy recipes? No. Oh wait, I want to check again. No, it doesn't reorganize them, damn it. Okay. Um, number 12, number 41, number Jubilee Village. A special parcel has arrived with your name on it. A modern jacket, modern trousers, and a pair of modern shoes. What a precious gift. Please take care of such fine attire. Okay. Caught one so I can show you one. I like that the people of this time are like so afraid of Pokemon. Sweet. Awesome. You, you wanted to see Wample. Oh, I have to give you it? Alright. Jean. 
I hate all of them. I'm so sorry, Wormple. I shouldn't have done this. I shouldn't have given him to you. Given you to him. What have I done? Okay, we can head back into town. Yeah, let's go, uh, catch ourselves. Catch ourselves another Wurmple. Although, maybe we should end the stream there for now and then start another one. Yeah, we'll do that. Thank you for watching. It's been fun. Pokemon! It's uh, Legends! Arceus! Uh, it's something like that. You say it's something like that. I I'm not quite sure. Uh, it's been fun. I'll see you guys soon. Twitch.tv slash Doxty. YouTube.com slash Doxty King. It's definitely a slower experience Pokemon game. But I'm all for it. I'm here for a new Pokemon experience. And it feels like it really is something else. And... I, I'm very excited to see where this game goes. So, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys soon. YouTube.com slash Stocksty King. Twitch.tv slash Stocksty. And bye bye now.